Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Soul Silver Randomized. The last time we left off, we cleared the lighthouse, and now we are on our way to Cinewood City to go pick up the medicine for the sick and for us. Today, as you saw, I said, and I fought uh, probably like half this, tra this route's trainers. Uh, probably not, honestly. Uh, actually, yeah, we're, we're actually almost at Cinewood City. So, I'm going to fast forward over all that, and the episode will start now, so we'll have like a, maybe a... 25, 40, 30 minute episode. Um, I still want to fight the trainers because, you know, I, I still need experience with some Pokemon, especially if we're going to be taking on the fighting type gym. Oh, and this dude has a full team. Alright, I wish I didn't fight him. So, this uh, is like one or two things I want to complain about. Uh, and that's recently with YouTube. Uh,. So, for those of you who may or may not know, YouTube has a feature where so you schedule your videos to come out on a certain day and a certain time. Um, and I rely on this feature a lot for my episodes. I, as soon as I upload them, I get them on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 12 p.m. every day, right? But recently, I found out that when I, when I set up my last batch of episodes, I think two episodes came out on Monday and one came out on Friday which I was really confused because I upload one set everything up and then move on to the next one so I don't like put all the dates in all at once like I make sure they all have different shit and recently YouTube's been just like nah we're not gonna put it out on the days you want it out we're gonna put it out whenever we feel like it and that that has led to some issues like I think like two weeks ago like when that like 17 or whatever like one of those episodes got mis mixed up mixed up I can't speak when the episodes got mixed up in the upload time like I I made sure that they were all labeled correctly and they all like but like the, the thumbnails were my fault because I accidentally mislabeled uh, them um anything for bug type so I guess we're sticking with you so my bad was the thumbnails because I just make a new batch every time I make it like I'll make like depending on how many episodes I record like I usually record one to five episodes at a time depending on how good I feel like if I have the energy to do it um, and then I'll make the thumbnails I'll go through one to five I accidentally deleted or not deleted I didn't delete all the ones from last time, so I had thumbnail one and two. So I had those two, like, that's how I ended up with a double eleven. But for some reason, like, I don't know. But either way, the uploads didn't go up on the proper days, and that really pissed me off, and I thought it was my fault. But then the same shit happened this week. So now I'm just like, hmm, do I... Because, like, I don't wake up early enough to- I stay up late and I wake up late, right? Like, I'm lucky if I wake up at noon, like, on the dot. Like, I go to bed at like 3 or 4 in the morning, I don't know, and I sleep like a brick. So I rely on those uploads, so now I'm thinking maybe like, instead of uploading them all at once, I'll upload them the day before, and have them scheduled. I'm probably gonna- uh, because I don't- I'm forgetful. Like, I don't check. I, I make sure everything is set up correctly and then I just leave it. Right? So, when I have everything set up, or like the way I wanted it, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I expect it to come out on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I just believe the system will work. But now the system's like, nah. I'm fucking Friday's going up on Wednesday, Wednesday is going up on Monday, and the Monday's going up on Monday. I'm like, no. What? Why? Who told you this? But I guess now I'm gonna have to either make really sure that I set it up all perfectly this time and take note, or I just don't and just fucking set them up the day before. Um, I'm not gonna go face that trainer in front of the World Island yet because we don't actually have anything to do in there until Gym 7? Lava, that's. I wish I had a Golava. 
I'm kind of bummed out that I didn't get to use it in Colosseum. Like, honestly, I would always go for Kulava and have it as, like, my main Pokemon in Pokemon Colosseum. And then said I got something. Flame Wheel, though. That's my favorite move to use with Kulava. I just imagine him curling up through a little ball and just fucking hitting someone. Uh... Best Pokemon for this would be Weirdo, sadly. Um, so we just... the first ten up, the first ten minutes were. All right, I'm looking at the timer. I'm thinking out loud. Uh, how I'm gonna. So like, like when it hits the timer hits thirty, that's when I'll stop. Um. Oh, the last week or so. I may have mentioned this. I don't know if I mentioned this last week, but I may try out Dreamcast emulation. Cough, cough. Because there's this game I've been watching and seeing people play called Ill Bleed, and it's like. A horror game but like not really it's really hard to explain I would say go look up like maybe the first wait is this a new route wait are we technically in Cinewood City I think we are I mean I'll catch it just in case I mean I'm not gonna be upset with Skitty I honestly like I, I love Skitty it's cute it's adorable Yeah, I want to play Ill Bleed, and there's some other games I want to try out, like... I may try to find a way to play Shenmue. Um, honestly, the games are really... They just look fun. Like, well, fun. Well, they don't look fun. They look actually pretty tedious. But, like, I just want to kind of, like, play them just, just, just to say I did. One, two, three... Eh. It's like Pokemon either get in this Pokeball or they just don't. We're we gonna call you. We're gonna call you Fluffy, cause you're a fucky kitty. Because I'm bad at nicknames. But yeah, I think right now we're technically in Cinewood. Route forty-one. Actually, either way, I think that was a new encounter. Yeah. And then Cinewood, I guess, doesn't count until like... Yep. So we can get another encounter right here. But first... Hey, Suicune, what's up? Yo, Chance. Wasn't that just... Suicune? I only caught a quick glimpse, but I thought I saw Suicune running on the waves. Suicune's beautiful and grand and races through the towns and roads at simply awesome speeds. It's wonderful. I want to see Suicune up close. I've decided. I'll battle you as a trainer to earn Suicune's respect. Come on, let's battle now. I mean, shit! <laughs> Ooh, Anorith. That's a good... I... When I first started pl uh, it's it's a random, this is just random, me talking. When I first started playing like Gen 3 games when Anorith and Cradilly were, Anorith and Lilip were, I don't know why I, I mentioned Cradilly, but um, when Anorith and Lilip were introduced, I would always go for Anorith because I thought he looked cooler, but as I got into competitive Pokemon, I would say in like Gen 5 and Gen 6, um, I mainly went for Lily or Cradilly because that dude's a tank and honestly he just is fun because he annoys people when you use him. Um, oh shit, Sire's still burnt. If you're a lot of creaking and cracking, I'm sorry, I'm moving my chair around and recently it's been really noisy. I honestly need a new computer chair. 
Mainly because, yeah, you know, it's just... I, I don't have a comfortable way to sit at this desk, honestly. Um, I sit weird. Honestly, if my legs aren't, like, up, uh, I just feel weird. Oof. Looks like paying attention to the burn, and that's my bad. Um, Mind Freak? Um, I'm... I don't know if I'm going to go around and trying to capture Entei, Ra Entei and Raikou. Because I, they, I don't know what they could be. Like, they could be anything, and I would never know it. Like, I want to, just for the experience, but I think Suicune's really the only one that matters. I, I don't think you need to catch either Entei or uh, Raikou to even get Suicune, and Suicune's probably not even going to be that good of a Pokemon, honestly, so... I'm not going to worry too much about it for now, but maybe... Maybe one day we'll just dedicate to trying to hunt down what Entei and Suicune really are, or Entei and Raikou, and we'll just go and try to catch them. Well then, good to see you. Goodbye. I can't look at Slowking without thinking of Pokemon 2000. Honestly, like, probably my favorite Pokemon movie. I don't know why. Maybe it's just the song, like Lugia's, like, song. Because I'm like, trying to think of, like, movie wise, I don't. I haven't watched any of the new ones. I still haven't seen the Magierna one. No, I really should. I haven't seen the Magierna one. Um, I don't think the Ziora one is out yet. I don't know why I'm pre still pressing it. I don't, I'm sorry. Um, I haven't seen the Volcanion one. I don't... Oh, wait, I haven't, I haven't seen the... Cre uh, the chrysalis fucking one with the uh, what's its name? Diancy. Um, you're amazing, James. I'm starting to understand why Suicune was keeping an eye on you. I'm going to keep searching for Suicune. I'll have a feeling we'll see each other again soon. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye, dude. Your name's confusing. Um. So I crossed the sea to get here. That must have been hard. It would have been much easier if Pokemon don't help fly. You can't use fly without the city to badge. Uh, yep. So I have a gift for Alright, so this girl will give us a fly. <gasps> we get a free Pokemon! That's right! Um, I believe we need to put a Pokemon away first, though. Um, normally, the dude here will give you a Shuckle. Um, we're going to give it a Yep, 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 yep. Sorry, I talked to you. So we'll take out Veneery for now. I'll still keep it down on the team list. But let's see what this Pokemon is that is gifted to us. Be hilarious if it was an Arceus. If that shit was an Arceus, and we could just go to the ruins of Alf and fucking. Uh, you're the pharmacy, so we need to talk to you to get the medicine. Uh, your new medicine, your Pokemon appear to be fine. Is something worrying you? The Lighthouse Pokemon is in trouble. I got it. This ought to do the trick. Alright, Secret Potion. I think this is the second time a Secret Potion has appeared in games. Uh, my Secret Potion is to have these strong. I only offer in an emergency. This is an emergency, I guess. Um, I think this dude gives us the shuffle. It's either this dude or... No, it's either this house or the one up here? No. I uh -uh. I'm speaking up my ass at this point. I honestly don't remember shit about this game. Uh, you. Uh, I'm shocked. A uh, guy about your age with piercing eyes and long hair came in. Uh, he scared me away. He scared me into giving away my prized Pokemon. I still have him left. Uh, yeah, I'll take it. You're probably not going to get it back, though. Alright, so normally this is a shuckle with some berry juice, but now it is a... Sand slash named Shuckle holding a berry juice. I mean, uh, he doesn't have really good moves. Um, 
Yeah, I'll just hold on. I don't... I'm gonna keep him, probably, but I don't... Uh, honestly? If it was an alone Sand Slash, this would be different, but regular Sand Slash is kind of booty. So, sorry, uh... Shuckle? I didn't. I honestly didn't think the game was gonna name him Shuckle. So let's go up our Pokemon, and I guess we're gonna take on the gym. Uh, I was gonna think about taking on the Safari Zone, but that's kind of a trek to get there. And the dude hasn't called us yet to say it's open, and I don't think it will open till the end. All right, so I beat the gym. But either way, let's go in the cave. Ooh, ooh, what the heck? I feel like the slowdown just happened, but I don't, I don't remember. Um, of course, I'm going to take a snapshot. Honestly, this was my favorite part of the game. I loved being able to just stand with our Pokemon outside of the fucking Pokeballs and just have a nice picture together. Like, honestly, that's my favorite part. Yo, if someone could, like, do fan art of that. And just, like, uh, maybe... Eh. If I can get... Mm. Honestly, that'd be great for like we got fan art of the entire team together like that. So the construction. So I guess we're taking on the gym today. Um, I'm not gonna stop halfway through. I think we're just gonna end after we beat the gym. Um, so this, the whole point of this gym is just to go up these rocks and turn off the fucking switches at the top. Um, we're gonna have to at least fight one trainer on each side, I think. Words are useless. Yeah, I don't care about you and you stupid stinky face. Um, since they're all karate dudes, like I said earlier, it's the fighting gym, so there's gonna be a lot of uh, dudes running around with fishes and shit, even though they're supposed to be karate masters. It'd be hilarious. If they all actually had fishes, like, ah, uh, I mastered the art of Sushido. Oh shit, that's actually a thing in a game series. So now I'm just imagining they're all murdering these Pokemon just to make sushi, to fight with the sushi. Did you really gotta do that? Did you really gotta do that? That's probably annoying, I'm sorry. Time to stop! Yo, when's this dude gonna evolve? Like, honestly? I don't remember Weirdo needing this much, like... Oof. Kinda need him out. Uh, so, as long as he doesn't know anything funky, we should be good. I think the most he's gonna know is Water Gun, maybe Crunch? Oh, scary face. Crocodile always weirded me out. Like, why does it look like. I don't know, like. Crocodile looks like an anthropomorphized caveman. Like, it looks like a dinosaur who had a human sona as, as, as like, a caveman. Like, I know that thing on the bottom is just, like, the pattern or whatever, but I always thought it was, like, an egg. <laughs> like, as a kid, I always thought he, for some reason he was sitting in an egg. Oof, I'm sorry. I did not realize he would have Ice Fang. Weirdo, you will be missed. Um, Sire, go in there and teach him how a real water type works, my boy. <laughs> uh, he's probably not going to be hard, but honestly, I just kind of want to heal now. I want to go out when I want to go to the Pokemon Center. 
That's it. Oh, I would have hated if it was a Shed Ninja. Because honestly, I don't think we would have anything to take down one. I don't know why I used that. Could you not? Why do you need so much speed? And evasiveness. All the stat boosts. No, what? You stop. You do not set up on me. Nah, I ain't having it. So that's two of the four trainers down. Um, I would hate going to. Do you think people go through this gym without their shoes on? Arnie. Click. Uh, howdy. It's Arnie, how are you? Uh, I'm with my worm bolt. So I don't. Get your nasty ass and your worm bolt out of here. Then. I would hate if someone called me up every five minutes to tell me about like, yo man, Wurmple, hella tight. Like, no, I don't care about your Wurmple. Tell me when it evolves. I don't care if you're, uh, I don't know, like, I don't care if your Psyduck went on an adventure and found an orange berry and tripped down the stairs. Oops. But, you know, like, do you think people are going to this gym without their sh like shoes on? I can see it happening, honestly. Uh, I think yeah. Now that we've get winning out, the gym resets, and we no longer have to fucking go across the bridge to reach the other button, or to go reach the button at all. Um, it's a nice workaround, but if you, I, I still want to go fight the other trainers just to get that experience. Um, it's not often. You get to fight trainers around your level on this. Um, since all the really good trainers are going to be over in Kanto. Spoiler alert. Um, Surskit. That's... You know, I really need something to start taking on water or bug types more efficiency. Like, I need, I need fire or some, like, electric type moves. Um, honestly, I might try to get either... Uh, I think we named the one Shadow, and I don't think we got the Manatric. You might have gotten Manatric, I'm not sure. Yeah, actually, no, I think we did get Manatric. Because I think at some point we did read the Pokédex entry, we're like... It makes its nest in thunder strikes and shit. I need to stop saying stuff like and shit. Uh, my raging fist will shatter your Pokemon. Touch them and you die. <laughs> uh, um, I don't have anything for grass types other than Jim! Jim, go in there and get your shit wrecked. <laughs> Come on, stop it. Um, I do if we do replace a Pokemon, it might be Dust. I don't think Dust. Is. If Dustox can learn fly, I mean, maybe, but honestly, uh, right now there's no really good reason to keep him on the team. He's not learning good moves, he ain't leveling up at all, he's not being helpful in battle, mainly because he's not leveling up, because he's not good in battle. That's like a never-ending cycle, isn't it? A Pokemon that levels up isn't good in battle at all, but you want it to keep growing, but it can't battle because it's not good. Like, it's learned no good moves, but it can't learn better moves until it levels up. <laughs> no. Stop. 
I don't know what that sound was I just made. The mm, it's, it's okay. Oh uh, no, but maybe think of One Week by the Bare Naked Ladies. I need to listen to that song. That's like one of my favorite songs. Digimon taught me about that song. <laughs> Shit, it's flying. Why did I hit with ground? Oh well. It used a door either way and wasted a turn, so. I'm fine with that. Oh, I should have kept Weirdo or someone out. And then switched in Desire. Um, I'll do that now, even though they won't get as much experience. Uh, actually, let's throw Jim out and then switch out because. Dude is way behind. Like, Weirdo and Buneary can at least, like, take a hit or two in battle. But this dude is just gone. He is just in the garbage right now. And that's all my fault. Because I didn't give him enough attention. Um, so it should be fine. That was garbage. So now we're going to go... Actually, no, I think everyone's fine, so let's just use some super potions. Actually, no, we don't even need super potions. Alright, cool. Alright, so let's go fight Chuck, or whatever his name will be. Oof, the pounded waterfall right onto my head. Or <laughs> I don't know why I'm giving him his ways. Why did you stop the waterfall from powering on me? You just spoiled my training. I have to warn you, I'm a strong trainer and I train every day under this waterfall. What? It has nothing to do with Pokemon. That's true. Come on, we shall do battle. We just came over and just was like, yo, we got nothing to do with Pokemon. What are you doing, you stupid? Poet Robin. Alright, you know, if that's his dream and aspirations, who am I to judge him for it? Um, I think. I think I got this in the bag. What do you mean? Okay, note to self, don't don't touch it. Don't touch it, don't look it, don't lick it. I'm surprised it doesn't actually play the flute. Yo, how crazy is it though? That we actually had a flute. Wait, is it grass bug or. For some reason, I thought it was like grass poison. Which, I mean, it's not 100% off to say, even though it doesn't use poison at all. I d oh, wait, that is physical attack. God damn it! <laughs> Flaffy. Oh man, I want Flaffy. Yo. Flaffy, Mareep, and uh, Ampharos, those things are great. I'm not a fan of Flaffy's form, but Mareep and Ampharos, though, I, I, I just love them. They're great. They're my children. If anything would happen to them, I would kill everybody in this room and then myself. <laughs> Could you... I mean... What are you gonna do? Hit me with a fucking electric attack? Try me. Try me, bitch. No, I'm, you're, you're a nice Flappy. You're just doing your best. I'm sorry. Can you stop? But this dude was ready. This dude was ready! Oh my god. Can you stop setting up? This is so annoying. Oof, that did absolutely- No! I don't want to use it again! Shit. I need to start using, like, Body Slam or something. Because that special defense is Rose, my boy. It is woke. I'm just saying things. Nothing I'm saying right now makes sense to me, but I'm just saying it. Come 
on. Uh, how much does this do? Hey, that's actual damage. Stop. You're getting us nowhere in this battle. I honestly wouldn't be surprised if he was waiting for that. Oh, so close. We lost. Hmm, I lost. How about that? Alright, you're worthy of the storm badge. Ba -da -ba -da -da. Ba -ba. The storm badge lets you Pokemon fly outside the city to begin with. You take this two, TM01. Did you just. Focus Punch? I doubt it. I doubt it. It's not going to be Focus Punch. I can tell you that right now. Withdraw. Wow! Wow! You just really did us dirty like that. That's the Cinewood Gym Badge. Then you should take this HM. Teach Fly to your Pokemon. You'll be able to fly instantly anywhere you visited. I mean, I would, but I don't think we got a Pokemon that can learn fly, to be honest with you. Yep. <laughs> Lady, we don't got that privilege. Um, I guess we'll check out the PC. Oh, wait. We do have a Pokemon that can learn fly. We do. I just remembered we got a bird. We got an edge bird. But, what do you want, Lyra? Hello, this Lyra, how are you? I was walking along with my Meryl and my Messiah, and I took it around and I saw it. It was Vol- Wait, you already told us this! Whatever. But, like I was saying before, somebody. Um, that's gonna have to wait till next episode. So, I hope you all had a wonderful time. Uh, if you liked the video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for more videos like this in the future. Follow me on Twitch if you want to catch my streams, mainly Pokemon just at the moment. A little bit of this here and there, you know, a little baba da boopa. Um, and until next time, bye bye